What's up guys? Welcome back to another video of Marvel Future Fight. You know, I've been slacking along in this game on this uh particular game. Um you may have noticed I have two save files or two games, whatever you want to call it. And you know, the one I'm making videos for, I'm slacking off on it because I'm thinking, yeah, I want to kind of uh feel the game as it is when it has been officially released. So I haven't been playing that much on this file and making videos for it. Alright, so now that it's officially released, we can move on. Let me just go on in here. Actually, I'm looking for some... Alright, there's nothing there. Okay, so we're in Chapter 4. Actually, in my other game, I'm in Chapter... I'm in Chapter 6 or Chapter 7. But I've slowed down on that as well, which I should really be moving forward. So that's why we're doing this. When we get to chapter 6 or 7, I'm going to switch to the other game. Because that one is just so much stronger. It's impossible for me to get there on this file. Especially when I spent all my money on the other game. Alright, so le let's go on in here, on the other save file rather. So reports are coming in. They're covering New York. Oh, right. One of the things is I didn't want to miss the story or they made any adjustments. Alright, let's move along here. As you can see, I'm using the analog stick. I don't like using the, the one touch. At the beginning, I was thinking the one touch is amazing. And then after I realized that you don't have that much control. I mean, it's still good. It's just that, I don't know, I prefer being able to dodge when I see the enemies hitting me. Because in that one, you can't really do that. You can't dodge when you see the enemy hitting you. Because they're just running up to them and then kind of, uh, I don't know, they're, they're just hitting them. And they don't really care if they're going to hit get hit or not, that's all. Since when can ninjas do fireballs? Or blue fireballs, anyways. Alright, you see him shooting at us right there. Really crazy stuff. Remember to break those things. You might get something out of it. The first time when I was playing, I didn't really care about them. Alright, we're doing really well because our level is actually pretty high. And there's Ghost Rider. Let's bring in Venom. I want to see a super with Spider-Man. Oh, that's it? Alright, let's bring Black Widow back. Alright, there we are. And we gotten 10 energy. Wow. I didn't know that they gave out energy. So that's something new to update as well. We're gonna fight Daredevil now. Let's try to finish off Chapter 4 in this video. Alright, I'm kind of lazy, so I'm going to run on ahead. I'm not even going to hit them. I'm going to try to gather them up. And then kill them all at once. Hopefully that will work. 
Or hit them all at once, rather. Too bad some of them don't, de don't get hit. You're just wondering, hey, you're in the lot, but how come you didn't get electrocuted? Alright, there's Daredevil. Let's bring in our Spider-Man. Let's blast him. Electrocute him. Punch him. I kind of wish that we could kill him in one hit. That would be cool. Alright, there we go. Oh my god. There are special bonus packages after you complete stuff. That's really stings. Why? It stinks because... Alright, let's close it. And we've gotten the sting. This ISO 8. It stinks because I already beat the stage on my other game. The game I want that I do buy stuff on. Oh, that really stinks. I didn't know that. They have stuff that come up. I only want to spend money in one game and make that game super powerful. I don't want to spread out and then buy it on different devices or different save files. Oh, wow. You know, that package was, was quite expensive, actually. If it was $30, it would be okay. But $50 is kind of expensive. Of course, we're on different accounts uh you know it w there will be different prices if you see let's say an australian account they will have a different price in australia if you're on the uk account you'll notice that there's a different price for the uk and then if you're on the canadian account then there will be different price as well you notice that in some of my videos i'm on the australian account and then some of them i'm in the canadian account and then some of them i'm in the uk account and then some of them, I'm in the U.S. account again. So there's different prices all around town, depending on where you are. And it's based on the U.S. dollar. They're all $100. It's just that some sort of conversion, I don't know, some other fees as well. All right, Kingpin, stop right there oh look there's the kingpin I'm standing right here I've always been here all I did was take one step <laughs> to the side into the light all right so let's go on there's Wilson Fist. oh boy a lot of discussion that's hilarious all right come on Let's beat up this thing. Now we're gonna bring in Captain America. Gonna blast him from afar. Maybe we should bring in Spider-Man. Just maybe. Oh, why are you hitting us? I'm surprised he's not hitting the Captain America. I like using the enemy, or I mean the ally as a decoy. All right, let's bring in Venom. And we're gonna use our special. Which is some weird move. There we go. You know, I've never gotten these stuff. These rewards in my other game. It's quite disappointing actually. Sunbathing time is over, Mr. Fist. It's time to go nighty night. Or night night. Alright. A mass assassination. Oh, wow. All right. We got to get back to base. Wah. I'm 
I, I, you know, I really want to finish this chapter. But the video is pretty long. Alright. It looks like it's going to be Winter Soldier. I think it's Winter Soldier. Assassination. Achievement unlocked. I gotta say that the rewards were better before. Oh no wait, we're done chapter 4. Yes! Alright, so that's the Kingpin in chapter 4. Red Storm. Up next, Rule the World Chapter 5, and I guess the boss is going to be Dr. Octopus, and then we'll go on to Red Skull for Chapter 6. Anyways, we'll continue on in the next video of Marvel Future Fight.